What is going on? Welcome back. And today we are at Wimmering Manor, right next to a church and a graveyard. You don't get more haunted than this. Now the building was abandoned in, I think it was 2017, 2016, and they started refurbishing it. I think they're turning it into a college. I don't know fully, but it's definitely looking newer, as you can see. I think this building was built in 10, oh, I don't actually know, I think it was 10, 10 something. So it's, it's very, very, very old. But the current version is from the, the 19, like 50s, I'm pretty sure. So the, oh my God. Oh, they are dolls. There are dolls up there. I want some explanation, that is not right. So in here used to be a nursery, as you can see where these like love hearts are. That used to be a nursery right there. And back here, all here, all these houses would have been grass. So behind the building was a massive field. So what I'm standing on now would have been grass, but it's not anymore. It's all just rows of houses that go all around the building. As you can see, you can just tell by looking at the building. It's very old. So, literally, there's so many pictures on Google. I can literally just comparison them. Comparison? Compare them, because to compare to what it looks like now, to what it used to look like, it almost looks the same, but obviously just in black and white and stuff like that. And, well, I mean, the, the surroundings are very different, but the actual building itself literally looks the exact same. As you can see, so there would have been, I'm pretty sure, there was a piano in that room there. I'm pretty sure, because um, in, tw I think it was 2016, me and my old mate Sam Dempsey, we came in here and we went through the basement uh, and we got, went into the building. But there was a glass thrown at us, so we had to run like out. And to be fair, I was, well think about it, I was 10, so no, well, probably 9, 10. So it's a lot different to when you're 14 compared to when you're 10 because obviously you're gonna run, aren't you? And under there is supposedly three miles, I think it's three miles of tunnel. It goes all the way up, so up there to the top of Portsdown Hill. So we could have got lost so easily. So I'm glad we ran out when we did. This building is very creepy when you look at it. I've been here at night before and it's not nice. Um, yeah, th this building is like really haunted. I've seen, if you go on YouTube and type up like Women Manor, you'll see Ghost hunts, a Ouija boards, stuff moving by itself, paranormal activities. There's so much like stuff around this place that just isn't supposed to be messed with. Sort of like a little garden. I think there's a shed right there. And a few years ago, I remember there was a um, an old car, like a really old car, uh, parked outside. And honestly, it looked like it was from 1980 at least, or maybe from before that. It was a really old car. And um, yeah, but I think I got a few pictures of it. I can't remember. I'm gonna have to look back at the old video just to see like what's changed and stuff like that. But yeah, this, this building is very creepy. I, I think I saw something on Google about, it's said to believe that there's a, a man on a horse that you can hear like galloping on a horse at night, like a, a ghost sort of horse thing. I don't know if I believe that, but it's it's still a weird, like, I don't know what to, is it a myth? Well, I don't know, because it's never been really been proven, so. But apparently it is a thing. But yeah, just down here, horses and stuff would have come up here, all the way up the lane, and right outside of where I'm at. Oh, there are, ta there are tag systems. See that? Tag systems. Well, they're growing a very nice sort of garden here. Oh man, look at that. That is textbook haunted. That is a well. I'm about to see the ring girl come out of that. It's sort of overgrown here. It, 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 oh, well, right, they're definitely doing something here. Look at all these wood chips. Massive pile of wood chips. The last time we came in, we actually climbed under this gate. As you can see, it's not a very big gap. I was very slim at the time. So we went under that, walked over there, past that bush, 
if I can point, it's right. I can't actually point, but it's that white door right there. That is the basement that we went through. And that's where we've got something thrown at us. So that's what makes me believe this place is 100% haunted. I don't know if this is true, but apparently in that top window, someone killed themselves. I don't know if that's true. I'm not going to say anything else because I don't know that it is true. I don't want to tell people that someone did kill himself because I mean, it's a very serious like, allegation, really, isn't it? So I don't really want to say that. And as you can see, literally, it is opposite a church. Like, you don't get more haunted than this. We have CEE, CEA, -E -E, 1849, 1843. That is insane. Cassandra Eliza, second daughter of Admiral Sir Francis W. Austin, KFB, and Mary, his wife, who departed this way on the 6th of May. 1849, age 35 years. That is old. 1849, we're currently in 2021. That is old. And then over here, opposite the building, there is a full graveyard. I'm sorry, but like you don't get more haunted than this. We have a church with graves, a graveyard, and the most haunted manor house in the UK. And I'm stood in between all of them. What? What is my life? What, why do I do this sort of stuff? <laughs> Honestly, don't, I have no clue. Also, I want to apologise. I haven't uploaded for about or, almost two weeks. I've been really busy football and that. Just recovered from a knee injury. I'm back into football. If you want to see some football videos, please put it in the comments down below. Or go over to my Instagram. Just tell me in my uh, recent Instagram posts. That works as well because I've gone there quite a lot. So yeah, if you do want to visit this place, I'll put the link to the Google Maps, like, postcode sort of thing in the description. And yeah, if you did enjoy this video, please smash like, subscribe. Uh, if you do want to come here, obviously, as I said, I'll leave it in the description. And yeah, I'll see you in the next one, in a bit of one.